Let's be honest, when you first hear the words Tesla flying car, it sounds almost impossible, right? Like something straight out of a science fiction movie. But here's the twist, it's real, and it's happening sooner than most people think. Elon Musk and Tesla are taking innovation to an entirely new level, and this time, they're setting their sights on the skies. From the very beginning, Musk has made it clear that Tesla wouldn't just be another car company. It's always been about pushing limits, taking risks, and turning wild ideas into reality. We've already seen it with the Cybertruck, the Tesla bot, the robo-taxi, and even the crazy-looking cyber van. But now, the flying car, Tesla's most ambitious project yet, might just redefine what transportation means. For years, flying cars have been this dreamy, futuristic idea that most people laughed off. I mean, who hasn't imagined skipping traffic by just taking off from their driveway? But while it sounded like a fantasy, several companies around the world have been quietly working to make it happen. These vehicles are designed to travel faster than cars, and yet be simpler to operate than planes. And here's where Tesla steps in. Because if anyone can take a crazy idea and make it real, it's Elon Musk. But before we dive into what Tesla's building, let's quickly look at the company that made the first big leap. Klein Vision. Klein Vision, a company based in Slovakia, shocked the world by actually making a flying car that works. Their car runs on gasoline and comes in a few versions ranging from 280 to 340 horsepower, pretty much like a sports car that can literally take off. It can drive like a normal car, and when it's time to fly, the wings fold out, the tail extends, and within two minutes, boom, it's ready to go airborne. In the air, it can hit a top speed of 155 miles per hour and reach altitudes of up to 10,000 feet. The company has already completed hundreds of successful flights, and the design looks sleek and futuristic, built from lightweight materials that make it much faster and more efficient. But here's the problem, it's expensive, really expensive. And that's where Tesla believes it can change everything. Elon Musk has promised that Tesla's flying car will be fully electric. No gasoline, no pollution, just pure electric power. And get this, Tesla claims it can build the flying car for only around $6,789. That's not a typo. It's less than 1 16th the cost of a Tesla Model 3. Crazy, right? So how can that possibly be true? Well, Tesla plans to use many of the same components already used in their electric cars. Motors, batteries, and software. This way, they can save billions in research and development while scaling up production faster. The heart of this flying car will be Tesla's powerful 4680 battery cells. These batteries are super dense, meaning they can store more power without adding extra weight, a crucial detail for flight. Too heavy, and the car won't lift. Too light, and it won't fly far. Tesla believes they've found the perfect balance. Now, let's talk about design because this thing is going to look stunning. Think of it as a smaller, sleeker version of the Tesla Roadster, but built for the air. The body will likely be made from super light aluminum and carbon fiber, with gullwing doors that open upward. The coolest part? With just the press of a button, the car transforms. In less than 90 seconds, wings unfold like a bird stretching its feathers, and the tail section extends for flight stability. The wheels even tuck into the body to make the car more aerodynamic. It's like watching a transformer come to life. But instead of using noisy propellers like helicopters, Tesla plans to use electric jet engines, inspired by the same propulsion technology used at SpaceX. These will be quiet, clean, and efficient. Plus, thanks to vertical takeoff and landing tech, you won't need a runway. Just a small open space, press a button, and you're in the air. On the ground, the Tesla flying car will behave just like any other Tesla. Fast, smart, and fully electric. It'll have dual motors, one in the front and one in the back, allowing it to go from zero to 60 miles per hour in just under four seconds. It'll also support autopilot and connect to Tesla's supercharger network. But once it's in flight mode, that's where the magic really begins. 
Early reports suggest it could reach speeds of up to 248 miles per hour, that's faster than most small planes, and travel around 300 miles on a single charge. And it does all this while consuming minimal power, thanks to Tesla's efficient motor system. Imagine skipping an entire city's traffic in minutes instead of hours. That's not just convenient, it's revolutionary. Now, you're probably wondering, but is it safe? And that's a fair question. Flying cars obviously face more risks than regular ones. That's why Tesla is focusing heavily on safety. The vehicle will come with a full-body parachute system, similar to what small aircraft use, that can deploy in emergencies to ensure a soft landing. There's also a unique air pad landing system, kind of like airbags for the ground, that cushions the impact if you land on uneven surfaces. Tesla's also designing it with multiple small electric motors instead of one big one. Why? Because if one motor fails, the others can keep the car stable. This redundancy makes it far safer than most prototypes we've seen so far. Production is expected to happen at Tesla's Giga Texas facility, and here's where it gets even more futuristic. Tesla will have a virtual flight testing center right inside the factory. Instead of flying each car outside for testing, engineers can run complete virtual simulations, checking aerodynamics, lift, and flight AI without ever leaving the ground. This saves time, reduces costs, and helps speed up development. Now, about that jaw-dropping price, $6,789. Realistically, that's the target price. The first few models will probably cost more, but as Tesla scales up, prices could drop closer to that figure. The idea is to make flying cars not just for the rich, but for everyone. Imagine one morning, you walk to your driveway, hop in your Tesla, press a button, and rise straight into the sky. No traffic jams, no honking, just you, gliding smoothly over the city. Sounds unreal, right? But if Musk has his way, that could be daily life by the end of the decade. Of course, it's not all smooth sailing, or smooth flying. There are still huge challenges ahead. The biggest one? Regulations. Governments haven't really decided how to manage flying cars yet. There are no clear laws for where they can take off, how they're tracked, or who can fly them. Then there's the technology itself. Balancing weight, safety, and power is a massive engineering puzzle. Tesla will also have to prove that these cars can handle bad weather, turbulence, and emergency situations. But if there's one company that thrives on solving impossible problems, it's Tesla. When can we expect it? While there's no official release date yet, many experts believe we could see early prototypes as soon as next year, with limited production starting around 2026. Widespread adoption might take until 2030, depending on how quickly Tesla clears the regulatory hurdles. But here's the thing. Every major Tesla product has faced delays before. The Cybertruck, the Roadster, even full self-driving. So it wouldn't be surprising if the flying car takes a little longer. But given Tesla's track record, it's not if it'll happen, it's when. Think about it. If Tesla actually pulls this off, the world could change overnight. Imagine cities without massive highways, replaced by small flight hubs or rooftop stations. Traveling to work, visiting another city, or going on a weekend trip could all become as simple as pressing a button. The Tesla flying car won't just be another vehicle, it'll be the start of a new era in human transportation. And just like Tesla changed how we think about electric cars, this might change how we think about flight altogether. So, what do you think? Would you take to the skies in a Tesla flying car? Because the way things are going, that question might be more relevant sooner than you expect. The future is coming, and this time, it's flying.